it's Vijaya and welcome back to my channel. Today I am putting an Indian spin on the classic grilled cheese. I love a good grilled cheese and in this one I am pairing it with a tomato chutney that is to die for. Now this grilled cheese is going to be ooey and gooey and it's going to be complemented so well by that tangy, spicy, sweet tomato chutney. When you smack those two together people, it's so, so good. But before we get started, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're loving the videos. And of course, if you want the full recipe, all you have to do is click the info box under this video and everything you need is there. Let's make some tomato chutney grilled cheese. And now we're gonna get going and chop up some tomatoes. Now this is the perfect opportunity to use up any leftover tomatoes that you have in your pantry that are getting kind of wrinkled. Those are super concentrated in flavor and are perfect in this because as they cook down, they become nice and jammy and sweet. Our tomatoes are all chopped up and now it's time to cook our chutney. And the very first thing that I'm gonna do is heat up some oil and add two really important spices that you may not be too familiar with. The first one are black mustard seeds. Now these guys are gonna pop in the oil and give the chutney an amazing texture, a little bit of crunch. And the second is hing, also known as asafoetida, and this is gonna give the chutney a little bit of a garlicky, leaky type of flavor, it's so good. Next, we're adding in four foundation ingredients that can be found across so many Indian dishes. We have some finely minced shallots. I have some finely chopped Thai green chili for heat, as well as some grated ginger and garlic. And we're gonna add those all in in one go and saute them off until they become nice and soft and fragrant. Now it's time to tip in those juicy tomatoes and again begin seasoning them with a different layer of spice. So I'm gonna go in with some cayenne chili powder for a little bit of heat, some coriander powder, which is nice and citrusy, as well as some ground cumin. For a bit of acidity, I'm gonna add a little bit of red wine vinegar, a little bit of brown sugar for that sweetness, and some salt to taste. Now, we're gonna cook this all down for about 30 to 35 minutes until it becomes nice and jammy, thick and glossy. Our chutney has completely cooled down to room temperature. At this point, you can store it in the fridge for weeks. And in addition to making great grilled cheese, you can also top some grilled meats with it, dunk your french fries into it. It's just so, so tasty. Now, let's move on to the cheese. I'm using two different types of cheese today. Mozzarella for its like gooey stretch factor and cheddar for its flavor. Now we're gonna grate those two up and then mix them together to create a nice cheese combo. Now you can use just about any bread to make this grilled cheese, from French to Italian to sourdough, whatever works for you. Today I'm using a crusty white loaf that I'm just gonna cut into some slices. I'm gonna butter one side of each slice so that it's ready to go with all the stuffings. So on the side of the bread that is not buttered, I am going to generously spread some of that tomato chutney all over the top and then sprinkle over some fresh chopped coriander for that bright green flavor. Now we're gonna layer in our mix of cheeses, sandwich this all together, and then we're gonna heat it on the stove on medium heat for about three to four minutes on each side until it's nice and golden brown and gooey in the middle. All right, let's give this guy a taste. You saw how ooey and gooey it was? Mmm. 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 You guys, you have to jump on the tomato chutney grilled cheese bandwagon. It is going to change your life. The combination of the spicy, sweet, and tart chutney with those ooey, gooey, creamy cheeses, the buttered, crisped bread is absolutely sensational. So the next time you're looking to switch up your grilled cheese game and make it a little more Indian, consider this one. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, feel free to give me a big ol' thumbs up. You know how that makes you feel. If you're new to the channel, thank you so much for joining me. Please subscribe for more videos. And as always, if you have a question, comment, concern, request, anything you wanna get off your mind, leave it in the comments box down below. Until my next video, I will see you all later. Bye. <laughs>